How sick do those finishers look? What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Apex Legends mobile video. In my last video, I showed you guys loads of leaks for Apex Legends mobile's next closed beta. And boys, thank me later, okay? I've got even more leaks for you from finishers to new legends. Trust me, you do not want to miss this. Even new game modes. So guys, before we start this video, I want to give a huge shout out to Error Public Labs for sponsoring me. Go in the description and click on the link to find out more information on the incredible mobile game, Game of Nations. Game of Nations is an incredible new idle role-playing adventure game where you can immerse yourself in an epic universe with a beautiful story as you unlock unique heroes from legendary civilizations. You can earn with its fantastic set of skills, you will always enjoy the company of epic heroes, mythical creatures and gods alike who will rally to your cause and trump your rivals in the clash of powers. The single player campaign is a joy to progress through but you won't want to neglect the PvP battles in the arena. They put your skills to the test and you will get generous rewards. I myself have been playing it for some time now and I am fully addicted. It comes along with incredible features such as recruiting mighty warriors for your army and unique heroes to fight for your cause. And also guys, the maps are literally insane. They are highly detailed all the way from Egypt to the wintry north. And I did say earlier, there is also a PvP mode which I have been playing non-stop where you can climb up the ranks in the leaderboards and get some awesome rewards. I myself have been playing it for some time now and I am fully addicted. So what are you guys waiting for? Conquer the world in your spare time and jump right into idle RPG game, Game of Nations to achieve glory amongst others. Again, the link is in the description. Go and download it now and play. Go! Okay, boys and girls, thank you for watching that uh, sponsor on Game of Nations. Now, let's get into the juicy stuff, okay? So currently, there is a playtest going on on Apex Legends Mobile where the developers at Respawn invite a few select people to test out the newer versions of Apex Mobile. A lot of leaks have been going around from that playtest showing some insane stuff from finishers to skins to higher FPS gameplay. Now the next closed beta is due in uh, probably about a week or two and the devs have made it available for more devices as well. So in my next video, I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to download it. Like I said, even if you've got the old Nokia 44 from the 90s. But for now, let's check out some of these insane leaks, starting with Legends. Okay guys, so the first one we have is Crypto. Crypto is a new legend that they're adding in and uh, I'm just showing you guys here exactly what he actually looks like in the game because we haven't actually seen him on the mobile version yet. But this is Crypto. He's basically like a surveillance sort of character. You can see there, look at the insane skins already that Apex are bringing us in these closed betas. Look at that, that's a hash f hack, uh, hack Frost skin. Looks dope. Dude looks like freaking some uh, Dragon Ball Z character or something. What's his thing? Goku? <laughs> uh, so yeah, we've got uh, some other ones as well. Hype Beast, Deadly Bite. Look at that. Look how sick that looks. A Deadly Bite skin. So again, guys, these, these are just some of the, uh, the, the the amazing sort of skins that they're going to be bringing to, uh, to some of these characters. I mean, just look at that one. Look how cool that looks with his sort of red shades. Um, but that's basically Crypto. Like I said, he's, he's sort of like a, a surveillance sort of character. He's not a a full-on aggressive character so he's, he's not my sort of character at all um this is showing his finisher in the game so like i said guys they've added finishers this is like a dummy finisher um it's gonna play right now and uh this is what crypto does he punches him in the face takes his little chip and uh walks off so uh yeah guys that's crypto let's get on to the next one okay guys next up we have mirage i know a lot of you guys love mirage he's always in the uh the sort of uh, apex legends videos he's always the funny he's, he's classed as the funniest character out of all of them but i'm just going to show you some of his uh cool skins as well mirage is quite an aggressor he has this sort of dummy uh, ability where he throws his own uh sort of uh, self out and confuses people and bamboozles them um so yeah yeah, you've got uh, his skins just there. His skins aren't the greatest. I, I, I think some of the characters have got better skins, but most of his are just sort of different color shades on them. Um, so it's not really anything special with him. There's one where he's got like a chain around his neck um, and some other sort of extra stuff as well. But yeah, there's, there's, there's not really anything special on him. But let's take a look at his finisher and see, uh, see what that looks like uh, compared to 
um, compared to Mirage's, so, uh, compared to Crypto's, sorry. So he does some sort of moonwalk, uh, spins around, kicks him in the face, and celebrates. So uh, I quite like Mirage's finisher. It's quite a, it's quite a, uh, a trolley one, in my opinion. So let's get on to the next one. Okay, boys, next we have Pathfinder, who's in the game. A lot of you guys like Pathfinder because he can use his grapple to sort of swing around the map and, uh, and make it easier for, for movement. His skins, uh, I believe, are just sort of reshaders again. It's it's nothing really special. Um, they're just different color shaders. But guys, if, if, you, if there's anything to go by on the Apex Legends PC and console versions, um, then you'll notice that a lot of the, the skins are, are much better than this. So it's only a matter of time before they come. Like I said, it's just a closed beta. It seems like they, they've, they've worked a lot on crypto skins uh, and a couple of other characters, but some of the characters, they've just added some color shaders. So that's uh, that, that's Pathfinder skins. You've got all of his legendary and, and sort of epic skins there. And now um, I'm going to show you some... Oh, bef before I actually go ahead, guys, yes, we actually have... Uh, banners and finishers as well so uh banner sorry banners and badges as well so you got banners where you um when you're loading into a game your banner shows up you can put little trackers on there to show how many kills you've got you know what kind of medals you've achieved or what or anything at all and you can see the medals just here so for this medal in uh, for instance is a um is a 3k badge so basically it means you have to get 3000 damage in one game to get the 3k badge as well as a 4k badge as well which is double hammers they're they're quite popular on the right you can also see there is a uh, 20 kill badge 20 little heads on here that's the same one on the pc version so the badges are really cool because you get to show off exactly what you know you, you you're about in uh, when you're loading into the game and other people can see that as well so the banner uh, badges and the banners are really cool and yeah they've they've added it looks like they've added animated um banners already as well yeah see uh, so we, uh, you can even see your character move on them as well, which is pretty cool. Now, let's check out Pathfinder's finisher. Um, I've shown you guys this before on Twitter, so don't forget to follow the Twitter uh, to check it out again. But yeah, that's uh, that's his sort of finisher, which is uh, which is pretty cool. So uh, yeah, let's uh, let's get on to the next one. Okay, boys. Lastly, we have. Revenant. So Revenant is like a, a death character. Um, he's got this death totem that he can put out, which makes you invincible, and he can silence enemies and make it so they can't use their abilities. They've actually uh, done some good improvements on his skins. As you can see there, you've got Shadow of the Sun, Bird of Prey, the Afterlife. So they've got uh, some pretty cool skins for Revenant. So like I said, it looks like they're doing sort of some sort of skins... Uh, for some characters and they're probably still in development of a lot of these skins but yeah there's not really anything interesting on those sort of skins uh i believe you get to see his banner movement uh yeah so you get little banner sort of animations like this fan and the swords and stuff as well so like i said it's really cool the animations you can pull on there um but uh but oh, oh he actually has actually so here we go here's his uh banner animation where the character sort of moves around and, yeah, does a little weird thing. So let's just check out his finisher, uh, which I showed you at the beginning of the video, but let's check it out again real quick. Yeah, look how good that looks. That literally looks insane. Uh, and there's so many different finishes you can get, guys. It's not just the basic ones. You can unlock new ones in the battle passes. So there's a lot to come in this game, and I'm hyped. Okay, guys, and uh, lastly is uh, this is the gameplay I wanted to show you. So from the looks of it, uh, the the person who's doing this uh, test at the moment has got a quite a low end device, as you can see from the sort of graphic details. But you can definitely tell that they have added more frame rate. So this is currently running at 60 FPS. Hopefully, this is going to be in the next closed beta. It's, it's most likely going to be since these play testers are doing it now. Um, but as you can see, uh, very smooth, very crisp. It's still the world's edge the second map one thing i did actually want to check out is bounce as you can see here i don't know if it's just the character revenant he's using but it doesn't look like they've added wall bouncing in the game yet one thing they have uh, another improvement i did notice that they added was uh doors uh, it's much easier and quicker to go through doors um you can't really see that there but much easier to go through doors um let's just watch some uh, some gameplay right here of him shooting lifeline so uh, it looks like the uh, the hit reg is a lot crisper and the hit boxes are a lot smoother uh, so they're definitely making a lot of optimizations on this game respawn are definitely doing a good job and i can't wait to see what the finished product is but this is actually revenant using his uh yeah his uh finisher in real life against bangalore which uh which actually looks insane so just on the map detail guys and and everything about this it looks 
incredible. Um, it's going to get even better. We've still got a long way off until the global release, I feel. We've still got a lot of optimizations to make, but I believe on percentage-wise, we're, I think, respawn are about 60 to 70% done on the game, and they've got another 30 to 40% to, uh, to finish it off. So... That's uh, that's basically the gameplay I wanted to show you guys. Uh, I'll just leave it on for a sec, and I that's going to be the end of this video. The next closed beta is coming out in one to two weeks from now. The next video I'm going to bring you is how to download it because it's going to be available on multiple devices instead of just the high-end devices now, which is great. Also, obviously, the soft launch should be coming within the next few months as well. And remember what I said, guys. When a soft launch comes, the global launch comes about three to four months later. And we're in July now. We're going into July. So... We need the soft launch pretty soon if we're going to get the global version by the end of this year. So that's basically the end of this video, guys. I want you to comment below. Let me know what you think of all these changes, if they're good, they're bad, any updates that you guys have. Uh, don't forget to hit a like and subscribe. And again, just thank you for so much for watching and uh, tune into the next one. I'll catch you in the next one, boys. Peace.